Hello watch fans, Beth here watches here and this time for you we have a men's Oris date pointer watch from circa 1950. Now this has, uh, as it says, a pointer for the date so it's pointing to 13 at the moment and to advance that on you just go past midnight and it will jump to 14. It does that automatically, it's a bit of a pain if you have to reset it to go, if you were say on the 11th today you'd have to go around quite a bit most people leave it uh, but if you're wearing it every day obviously that's not a problem sub seconds dial so you've got four hands on this and you'll notice that this has gilt numerals as well so both the numerals and this track around the outside known as a railway track that's in gilt dial is original and there's a couple of smudge marks on it there is what you would most people would call patina or damage but it's not that bad. It is from 1950 or maybe even earlier. The bezel is brass, the case is chromed and the case back is stainless steel. And the crown or some people call it a button is also a brass finish. So it marries up nicely. Manual wind in-house movement, ticking along nicely and the strap is new. Quite an unusual piece to find, I think you'll agree. And I would say this is uber cool. This is not the flash diver's watch that Oris maybe most people might think of, but the date pointer is still something they do in their range. I think it's on the big crown models. They're, that's gonna cost you 16, 17, 1800 pounds. This is a vintage watch. It's gonna be way, 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 way cheaper. To see more on this, click the link we've put in the pinned comment below. And if you like interesting old watches, please consider subscribing. The button's there, use it. See you next time.